I want a girlfriend for a lot of different reasons, but I just don't know where to find a girlfriend at. Hold up. Have Ari Fletcher and Young Miami really been hooking up this whole time? Well, y'all better tighten up for this one because the feud between Tyena and Ari just got a whole lot messier after Tyena put Ari on blast for turning lesbian and sleeping with Young Miami behind money bags back. There have been rumors for a while now about Miami and Ari getting freaky with each other ever since Miami ditched JT to become BFFs with Ari. Both Ari and Miami have explicitly said in the past they don't mind getting with other women. In fact, Ari and Miami have both been caught kissing each other on the lips, and Ari admitted a while back that she loves organizing freak-offs with other women because she genuinely enjoys having her cha-cha eaten by women rather than sleeping with men. Now, it's unclear why exactly Tyena felt the need to clown Ari for this, especially since she's clearly been open about her sexuality. But people ain't really that surprised because Tyena and Ari have been on each other's necks for years now, and it has to do with both of them being linked to G Herbo. It's still exactly unclear what triggered their entire feud, but there have been rumors that Tyena was hooking up with G Herbo while he was still with Ari. What makes it even worse is that Herb was cheating on Ari while she was pregnant with their son, Yosan. Herb was initially hesitant to speak on the rumors, especially since he and Ari had moved on. Tyena, on the other hand, just flat out lied out of her mouth and denied ever being involved with Herb while he was with Ari. But after years of them gaslighting Ari into thinking she was making stuff up, Herb finally decided to admit everything and confirm the rumors during an episode of Young Miami's career Risha Please, where he admitted to cheating on Ari with Tyena. What's even worse is that Herb actually said he had no real reason for cheating. He simply did it because he wanted to, and then had the audacity to make Tyena his main once Ari left. Did you cheat on um, Ari with Tyena? Yeah. Why? <laughs> Technically, yeah. Why? Yeah. I was young. I was dumb. I didn't know no better, man. I was just doing. I was just, you feel me, like just cheating. I feel like I want. I ain't gonna say I was just cheating, but it's like me and Ari was at a space, and I didn't talk to her about this already. Like mm -hmm. I didn't already say my beard, my piece, and apologize. We was at a space where, like, like I said, mentally, like I be going, and I gotta like separate myself. from so. Ari also accused Tyena of gaslighting Herb into putting his hands on her in front of their son, and even went as far as to dragging him to court for it. She said, He kicked my door down to get in my house because I wouldn't let him in. Be fuel out of me in front of my son. Then he took my son outside to his friends and had them drive off with my son, hid all my knives in my house, broke my phone, and locked me inside and beat the F out of me again. Ch me, punched me in my face and all over my body, dragged me outside on the concrete by my hair after his friends drove off with my son, took me in the house and continued beating me. He wrecked my whole house, broke all type of ish. I have a black eye, my body scraped up from being dragged outside, and cuts all over my body. Please don't speak on no old relationship play fights, cause this ain't that. And do y'all remember the time Tyena and Ari got into it after Herb gave Yosan a Tyena to babysit and Tyena literally cut off all communication between Ari and her own son? Ari wasn't having that at all, so she decided to leak Tyena's phone number on her social media. She also followed it up with this tweet that said, my child was left in her care and she took my son outside somewhere and I called to check on my son. She had my number blocked and told her, Mama, I can't have her number and take it up with her. If I can't have a contact on who has my son because you don't like me, then you shouldn't have my son. So now everybody got your number, cause find somebody else to play with. So as y'all can see, Tyena and Ari don't like each other at all. So it's honestly not surprising that Tyena decided to clown Ari once rumors started about her turning into a lesbian for young 
Young Miami. Now, as I said before, people have been speculating about this alleged relationship between Ari and Miami for a hot minute now. The rumors got fueled a few months ago when Ari appeared on Carisha Please and literally kissed Miami very passionately on camera. They both seemed real comfortable with each other, and people said it looked like that wasn't their first time tasting each other's lips. Ari then fueled the lesbian rumors even more when she revealed during an interview with Angela Yee that she actually is bisexual and that she dated a woman for three years before giving any man a chance. She also said that she likes hosting freak-offs in her house with only women and that she's the one who usually picks the women whenever she and Moneybag are about to get it on. Get in trouble for that. There's a lot of things going on. You trying to tell us you was freaky? We trying to figure yeah. it out. Mm -hmm. Threesomes are a great time. I genuinely like women. Like that was my. I had sex with a woman before a man. Like I Same. really, I'm really into girls. Like mm -hmm. on my own. Like I don't have threesomes. Like because that's what he want to do. Like that's what I want to do. You know, like you. I mean, of course he want to do it, but you know, it's like he's with it. I really, yeah, <laughs> like I really like women. Like I'm into women. Mm -hmm. So you're so, bisexual? Yeah. I okay. dated, like, I've been in a real relationship with a girl for three years. Like, mm -hmm. I've had sex with numerous women. We're all bisexual except for Angela. Angela. Yeah, I never did it. Why did you and your girlfriend break up? Um, that's, that's just get toxic. It was real toxic. Fighting, going to the hospital, just... Oh, shit. I, it was it was bad, mm -hmm. and then I was younger too, and I was I got me a man. I was like, I'm about to go get some dick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to go get some dick. Like I'm out here, gotta go. Then I, after that, it was like all fun with girls. Like I never. Oh, one other girl it was like I act that I actually liked and I consistently talked to. But besides her, and we weren't in a relationship. It was just like a thing. Mm -hmm. But everybody else was just like a fun time. No. For Miami, she's also expressed her own interest in women, especially during that one episode of Carisha Please when she had Megan the Stallion on. She told Meg she enjoyed getting intimate with women more than she did with men. She also said she realized she was bisexual when she found herself liking lesbian corn way more than the straight people corn. Talking to me in your sexy voice. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go to dinner after we leave. We can. <laughs> what you want to go eat? I like sushi. You like sushi? Okay. So, okay, you like you like girls? <laughs> I mean, I like what I like. <laughs> I like you. You do? I do. You a <laughs> <laughs> What you say it like that? Because what you me? Yeah, I would. So who on top? Me. Mm. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> it's no. definitely giving top, you know that. <laughs> okay, I'll be a bottle for you. After this very flirtatious interaction, they was also caught kissing at a party. So as y'all can see, both Ari and Miami have been very open about their interests in each other and have made it very clear on numerous occasions that they go both ways. So it's honestly confusing that Taina would even try to speak on this, as if it was something new that Ari was supposed to be ashamed of. Ari actually saw all the commotion and decided to go on live on TikTok and check Taina and any other hater who got something to say about her being bi. She said that despite her and Miami being real touchy with each other, they've never gotten intimate, and that people should stop speaking on what she decides to do in the bedroom. I keep asking that me and Garisha should be having why do y'all ask that? Is it from the interview? And I don't think that having sex with your friends is a good thing because I have done that before and it's just like, it's just not something you should do. It just makes it like, it don't make it weird, but it's just like, I be f***ing you. Like, I don't want to really be your friend like that. You know? I don't know. I do need a girlfriend. That's crazy you said that. So I actually have been talking about getting a girlfriend. Um, Like... I want a girlfriend for a lot of different reasons, 
but I just don't know where to find a girlfriend. As usual, people had their own thoughts about this mess. Like this person who said they probably got down once, maybe twice, but then decided the friendship is more important because including will definitely complicate the friendship. Another person said, they grown and it's really nobody's business. They are both beautiful women. And if you are a woman attracted to other women, you can see why they feel in each other. If they like it, I love it. But now I want to know your thoughts. What do y'all think about Taina allegedly clowning Ari for being a lesbian? And do y'all think Ari and Miami are really hooking up on the low? Y'all been knew what to do. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And don't forget to click here to watch this other very messy video.